Conservation and land management is about the future of rural industries. The thing that I'm most interested in is changing the perception that conservation and land management is only for greenies. The fact is conservation and land management is for all of us. And the Australian Agricultural College Corporation leads the country with its courses. So you only find them here in a very small area. It's important for the students to monitor the populations here so we know how they're being um, impacted on by visitation and other land uses. We cover a large area from Cardwell right up to the tip of Cape York. Conservation and land management studies hub out of campuses in Mariba and the Burdekin. We've got so many opportunities up here. We're close to the Cape, we're close to beaches, we're close to rainforests. So we've actually got wet tropics, we've got dry savannas, we've got tropical woodlands. Giving access to heritage listed nature areas. Have a look at these beauties. All cowries, these would be upwards 200 years old. We're very fortunate to have these trees right here in our backyard. Before you can learn how to manage it, you have to know what you've got there. So often we'll start off teaching, recognising animals, recognising plants, learning so that when you go out to the environment, you know what it is that you're looking at. We've got some native bees that are attracted to this sap on the tree. Signage, path construction, all aspects of impact minimisation are examined. So the tracks are in place here to keep it looking pristine and that's how we want to keep it okay, so let's go. Understand what plants go where, understand what they need to do uh, in terms of managing weeds and managing fed, feral animals and pests and things, and they go out and do most of that. That's it, excellent. They're some of the best rainforests in the world and we're going to make sure that they stay that way. Making the college the natural starting point for careers in national parks or forest related industries. We found that their favourite juice is 100% mango and apple. Students also gain unique wildlife experience. If you're going to live on the land, you need to work in with, with nature and you need to understand nature specifically for the area you, you live in. For the difficult issues facing today's rural industries. So we need to work in with them and not destroy the environment for, for them. Now if I can just suggest what would make it easier for them, just a bit more space. This is a situation where the birds aren't presented in the cage, not just birds but other animals too that are, that are found throughout the, the region. From the temperature, the salinity and the oxygen, it actually looks as though it, um, this particular river is in good health. As water supply becomes more critical, our understanding of it must also grow. OK, fellas, see here, we've got too much water happening here. Can you see the problem? So the college teaches best practice techniques for protecting and managing this valuable resource. Learning about ecology, um, how to fight bushfires, uh, lots of uh, stuff about animals and plants. All right, guys, we have ignition. Not just conservation knowledge, practical rural land skills so students emerge job ready. Check the end of the gun, make sure there's no dirt in there. And wipe him. Oh, I'd never really worked on an engine before. All right, you just check that again for me. Huh? Our students also learn financial skills and financial management skills. They learn workplace communication and they also learn how to read industrial awards. All right, if you could look down the menu on the right hand side. It had a lot of different things in it, so it was, you know, wide variety. So if you wanted to try and get into parks, you can do that, or, you know, try and get into natural resources, you can do that. It doesn't just limit you to, to one specific job. The Australian Agricultural College Corporation. First choice for a career in conservation and land management. <laughs>